In the last tutorial we learned how to move a cube with keyboard keys. In this video I will teach you how to move a cube or any game object with UI buttons. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. As you can see I have continued the project and uh, also opened up the C sharp script which we make in the last video and in this video we want to make this cube move here and there with the help of buttons. So first of all I, I will change background color for better look. Uh, so this is looking cool. Let's right click over here and create UI and canvas. Again right click UI and make a button. Put uh, rename it and call it left. And move it little bit to here duplicate it and move it little bit left and uh, or delete it for right now and let's change its image and search for backward it's looking cool I will Let's make it a little bit bigger and it is looking cool here. Let's delete the text. Again duplicate it and rename it to right and move it little bit left and change again picture forward so as you can see I have created two buttons looking pretty nice and uh, We want to use this button to move this cube here and there. So I will I will go to the script and make a new variable. Let's make a boolean public. Boolean is walking. And uh, let's make it false. make it and let's change its name is walking left make a make another variable make another variable call it public boolean is walking right equal to Waltz. For left, let's delete this code from here and put put boolean here. Let's copy this this boolean name copy from here and paste it over here and for right copy this right variable and delete this code from here and paste it here let's make an other function public void is 
trigger left here you have to make another boolean and call it can move left And the sign is walking is walking left equal to equal to can move left so let's see let's click on left button and uh, add component and search for Event trigger add event on pointer down and on pointer up. Let's put game manager here again, game manager here, and click on movement and is trigger left. Movement is trigger left. Check for this boolean. And let's see whether it's working or not. So it's working properly. Again, do this for left button. Make a new function. Call it public. Sorry. Public. Make another function for right. Public. What? is trigger right and make another boolean here boolean can move right So again is walking right make it equal to can move right so let's save this and go back to unity and again click on again click on right button search for event trigger and add component add event data and click on pointer down and pointer up drag and drop game manager here also here go to movement and search for his trigger right again movement is trigger right and check this boolean again so let's check whether it's working or not okay it's working for left and also working for right awesome in the next video i will teach you how to make a main menu and a jump system for this cube i hope you guys enjoy the video so please press the like button and subscribe for more videos